Details remain sketchy about a man who was shot in the face in a quiet Sunnyvale neighborhood. He was bleeding from his face. He tried knocking on doors, ended up walking nearly a mile to a convenience store to get help. ABC 7 News reporter David Louie talked to residents about the gunfire they heard outside their homes. Residents of Snowberry Court were preparing to call it a night when the quiet of their cul-de-sac was shattered by the sound of gunshots. And I heard two sharp bang, bang noises. And then I heard a, a, some sort of voice, a car door slam, and then a car speed away. Kathy Wimble's husband walked up and down the short street about two minutes later, but saw nothing. Police arrived and began to investigate what had happened and whether anyone had been shot. There was a victim, a man in his late 20s or early 30s. After getting shot in the face, the victim left the neighborhood, walking down this sidewalk, leaving a trail of blood. He eventually made his way to a nearby 7-Eleven that was open. Nine to ten minutes later, he 